What's up guys? Welcome to my 50th video. I'm gonna do a little tour of my room. I'm gonna call this up at the top, Tour of My Room, Episode 2. Cause it's not really part two, it's episode two, because uh, it's kind of more of an update because I haven't done this in a while. So there's been changes. So yeah, so let's get started. Oh, uh, first change, got a record player. Just jamming to Rick Astley, you know. Oh, what do we got over here? Okay, so this is my new bed. I used to have a bunk bed, the bottom of a bunk bed. And then now I've upgraded to the uh, bigger bed. Yeah, so uh, up here, that's a uh, picture of me and my dad at the Star Trek convention, which is uh, kind of nerdy. But uh, it's me and John Franks from the service. That's what I'm most proud of. It's me and uh, William Shatner. Okay, so there's some Star Wars action figures. No gear figures. Over here is my 1-6 uh, collectible movie figurine collection. Or uh, dolls. Got Freddy over here. Got some X-Files figures back there that you can't really see that good. Got, some James, got James Bond right there. Some Golden Eye. Got Solid Snake right there. Okay. It's my uh, original costume Hot Toys Batman. I uh, have a review of this in one of my earlier videos. People have sent me comments asking me if this thing is for sale. Uh, and he's not. Unless uh, you want to give me $600 on these yours. Uh, there's the Toys McCoy Indie. Down here is my Sideshow Indie collection. There's the uh, Tote figure with the Ark of the Covenant. Uh, which I guess I could do a review for one day if someone wants it. Down here is my Blu-ray, PlayStation 3, DVD collection. Got my PS3 games. Modern Warfare 2, Hardened. Gotta have that. Um, Uncharted 2. Got my Blu-rays here. Got some... Let me check those out. I got some... You can pause this if you'd like. Got some Steven Seagal in there. Some Blade Runner, Dark Knight. It's growing. Slowly, but it's growing. Alien, Die Hard. Every guy movie's there, you know. Down here, got my Friday the 13th collection. The bare bones releases, but uh, yeah. And there's the Nightmare on Elm Street collection. And there's the Hot Toys Dark Knight box. We got some Seinfeld back there. Back to the Future, Star Wars. And then here's kind of my uh, little magazine collection. Got Game Informer, Game Pro, PC Gamer, Mix. I think out of all of them, I, I think I like Game Pro and uh, Game Informer the best. Oh, I had PlayStation Magazine for a while too. Got some. Odds and ends. Looks down there. Over here is my uh, Windows 95 computer, um, which I used to play all my uh, kind of old Windows 95 DOS games, all the classics. Uh, so here's kind of my second desk. My main desk is uh, over there. Um, yeah, uh, here's my uh, Lucas Arts hat, which I wear when I play my games. And uh, yeah, right now I'm playing here's my classes. Got Tune Struck right here. I got Blade Runner, which I'm playing. And uh, got some games out of here. Got some King's Quest. Got some Full Throttle, Grim Fandango, Monkey Island, everything you need. There's my alarm clock. There is a Crystal Skull poster. Up here, I've got some vintage indie figures from Raiders of the Lost Ark. As you can see, I made name tags for all the figures, but I only uh, collected uh, these ones, and then I kind of stopped because it uh, got expensive. So moving on over here, we've got the uh, got Con Kurt there and the Movie Masters joke figure, which was for a time a very expensive figure, but now you can get it pretty cheap. Various posters and stuff. The record player, which is nice. Um, that's what I'm watching now. On Deadly Ground, Steven Seagal, good flick. Got my Netflix here, Mummy Returns, Blue Rizzle. I have several consoles, but they're uh, hidden away. You can see them in past videos, but right now I just got the 3D of the Xbox and the PS3. Right over here, we've got the uh, 1080p HD TV, which I recently acquired. Very nice television. Um, I think I was expecting more with HD, but uh, my eyes aren't that good anyway, so. Uh, down here we've got the VHS player for playing the uh, Class X. 
Temple of Doom right there. And you have the laser disc player. Just pop this out of here. As you can see, these snacks got thicker since the last video. Oh, there's a laser disc movie down here. In the line of fire with Clint Eastwood. Good movie. Okay, close that on up. Okay, so we'll move over to here. And this is where my uh, my DOS games, my Windows 95 games, kind of hidden. I've just been collecting them for a very long time. I got some rare ones in here. Got a TIE Fighter in the box. There's Blade Runner. Um, old Sierra game. Dagger of Amon Ra. Some Star Trek games in there. Uh, Phantasmagoria 2. Beast Within. In their boxes. Got the LucasArts Archive. Which is uh, quite expensive nowadays. It goes for about 90 to 100 bucks on, uh, on eBay. Or Evil Bay, whatever you want to call it. Then right there I have uh, a Zork in the box. And then I have uh, Avid Express Pro, which is a professional editing software used in a big budget Hollywood films. So yeah, we move up here. This is kind of the desk. This is where the action happens. Oh, oh look, it's my uh, main page. What do you know? There's a Police Knots video. Check that out if you haven't. Okay, we move down here. Got my uh, DS. We got my DS right now. Brain Odge. Got some Brain Odge in there. Okay, got some various CDs. I'm a big fan of uh, John Williams, Brad Pack, teen 80s films. I like to get the CDs for them. One right now, well, as you can tell, I like 80s. Drinking an 80s Pepsi. It's the taste of a new generation. Okay, and then the uh, iPod Touch, second gen. Got my PSP there. Yeah, so that's pretty much my desk. Got a spindle of Various games. That here it got outlaws there. It's a good game. Yeah, so um that, that's the backyard. For anyone that cares. Yeah, so that's pretty much my room. You can kinda go around here. Yeah, so uh if anyone wants me to do a, a video on a specific section of the uh, room certain collection I have or something, uh, let me know, and I'll be happy to do it. So yeah, so I hope you enjoyed my 50th video. Subscribe if you haven't. Rate this down at the uh, bottom down there. And uh, yeah, catch you guys later. Uh, I don't know what's coming next. Uh, see, see what happens. Catch you guys later. Bye.